Hi guys, this is Joe from Techilobang. Welcome back to this channel. Today I'm sitting in my sofa because I want to test out three things. First is the Jabra Evolve 230, and the second one is the Poly 7225, Black Wire 7225, and the third one is the Poly Black Wire 8225. So these are the three models of headsets that I have with me right now and I'm going to use them to test out a few things. One is of course the comfort level when wearing them. The second one is how good it is for them to cancel away the surrounding sound. And of course the last one I wanted to test is definitely the microphone. Whether their noise cancellation microphone is good enough to be used in a noisy environment or not. And to test it out, I have my decibel meter over here and it's linked to an app that I can record now so that you can see the, the overall results. I have a TV set right now that, that I am using another phone to film it. So I will be playing some rather loud music or loud sound to simulate the environment and from there we can see how good it is I'll be using the zoom app so that I can record down everything clearly um, it's just like a it's just like a office environment whereby I'll be conducting a meeting and then I'll be using the headset to talk about it and at the same time I'll be playing some background noise or surrounding noise and I also prepared a vacuum cleaner so that we will be able to really test out all these devices or headsets so that we can really come up with a conclusion which one is the best. Without further ado, let me show you the three devices. For this one, this is the Jabra Evolve 2 30. So this is a very affordable headset from Jabra and I feel that in terms of the design wise it's good enough. Comfort level is also not so bad if you can see that there's a sponge over here whereby you can comfortably put your mic over here and then you can talk. So in terms of comfort level and design this is a very basic model. If you are looking for a very durable one, I would think that this might not be the case because many of the things are made of plastic. So you should know when plastic is easy to get damaged. Okay, this is the first one. The second one is the one that I bought online and you can see that there's some damage over here. It is due to my mistake. Um, and also it proved that if I'm not very careful with it, I will spoil it. And what, what did I do is uh, I accidentally twisted it and actually the plastic cracked. And you will also notice that for this for this device, for this headset, there is no boom mic. Everything is based on the surrounding mic to cancel away the noise. In terms of comfort level, I think this is quite comfortable and I feel that I feel that with this sponge over here is also helping a lot in terms of uh, pressing down to your head and then to make yourself more comfortable when talking long time on the maybe the zoom app or on any other platform and final one is a review set this is a review set is the 8225 black wire 8225 from Poly and it has a boom mic like this so in terms of the shape it looks as almost the same as the 7225 but then uh, it's just that it has a boom mic and I feel that the quality wise if you look carefully the quality wise is much better it's much better and I feel that it's much more durable and there's also the sponge over here and it's a slightly different design however the the comfort level is in my opinion good and just for your information for poly right you can actually 
turn to this side. No doubt this is the right side, but then you can actually turn to this side and the boom mic should be able to come down and you can use it on the on this side. So regardless of whether you want to use on this side or you want to turn your head no turn your headset to this side, it is achievable using the poly black wires 8 to 2 5. So right now I'm going to use my laptop my laptop to run a zoom meeting okay I'll be running a zoom meeting and I'll be I'll be talking in the zoom meeting and everything will be recorded using all these headsets okay I have just connected it to the Jabra Jabra Evolve 230 so it is connected so I can actually use it immediately and before I start right let me let me show you what is the ambulance noise right now this is the actual ambient or surrounding sound right now about 60 something decibel so I'll be doing a meeting without without um, external interference first and then after that I'll be using using some external interference to record now so that you can hear the differences okay so let me start recording this meeting okay good morning everyone this is Joe from Techiloba I am now having a meeting by myself and I'm using the I'm using the Jabra Evolve 230 to test out the sound quality as well as the cancellation noise cancellation feature in this in this headset. I have with me the I have with me the decibel meter and it's showing about 60 something to 70 in terms of the sound level. I have two air conditioners that is turned on in the living room. It's quite cold right now. And I also have a TV that is going to be running some videos to simulate the external sound. So right now, let me introduce the sound surrounding sound. So you can see that the noise level has reached to the 78. Let me increase some more while I'm still talking on the on the Zoom meeting. So imagine that if I'm conducting a Zoom meeting in such kind of environment, which is very loud in my opinion, this is really very loud in my opinion, you will know, you will realize that if you don't have a good noise cancellation headset, you will be talking louder and louder in the meeting because you will feel that I need to overcome that outside noise. The noise cancelling cancellation headset that means the ambience noise will come inside your 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 headset and then you can only use use this to achieve the passive noise cancellation so in that case it might not be it might not be so good and also another factor that you need to take into account is the is the noise cancellation mic it must be very good so that you can actually able to cancel away the noise so let me stop the noise from the outside and uh, let me bring in my vacuum cleaner okay let me bring in my vacuum cleaner this is okay Okay, uh, just another important point about wearing a headset is your microphone must be well fitted to your face or near your near your mouth area whereby the sound will come out so that they are differentiate they will be able to differentiate between the uh, ambient sound and also between the uh, sound from your from your uh, from your mouth. And okay, okay, so for this for this headset, right? 
the microphone is quite near to the quite near to the face, so you have to adjust it accordingly. And I find that the headset is sometimes slipping away, so so it's quite a challenge sometimes. Anyway, it's okay. Let, let's move on to the next headset so that we can keep on trying out. Okay, let me plug in the next headset. Okay, let us continue with the test. Now I'm using the Poly Black Wire 7225. That that is a headset that is a headset without the boom mic. So right now I'm only using the the surrounding mic to capture my voice. So I have my Zoom meeting ready and I'll record down the Zoom meeting. Okay, good morning everyone. This is Joe from Techilogan. Welcome back to this meeting. And it's a one-man show meeting whereby I'm going to test out this headset, which is the Poly 7225. And right now I am using the surrounding sound only without additional sound in, in this room or in this hall. I have two aircon that is running and one big fan that is turning on top of me and that is it. So the sound quality should be good or should be better than the next one that I'm going to introduce which is a lot of noise from the from the TV. And right now you can see that this is right now at 60 something decibel. Okay, 60 something decibel. So I'll be I'll be turning on the TV and talking at the same time. So you can see that you can see that the noise video goes up to almost 90. And I have just for the information, I have a noise cancellation over there, which is a very basic noise installation, and also have a mic noise cancellation on this Noise from the from the surrounding and also the any noise that is captured by the mic from the surrounding. So of course it and yeah, that's it. And let me review the video. So yeah, let me review the video. There's one thing that I forgot to test just now, which is the vacuum cleaner. So I just want to share with you what is the decibel for this vacuum cleaner. It is around 70 something. No, 70, yeah, 70 something to 80. So this is the noise from the vacuum cleaner and I'm now talking onto the Zoom meeting. So that means I should be able to capture the noise from the vacuum cleaner and my voice and see how good it is in terms of noise cancellation from this system. Yeah, that is it for this. So let me review the result and we shall see how good it is. This is my favorite set. It is the Poly 8225. It has the noise fencing capability whereby it's able to fence off something that is uh, maybe a few feet away from you. And I I believe it worked very well because uh, in my many meetings daily, People say that my headset seems to be the very quiet and uh, without any disturbance from the ambience or from the surrounding sound. So right now I'm am not introducing any new. It's uh, around sixty, if I'm not wrong. Yeah, around sixty decibel. So I'll be introducing new. Okay, just make sure that you have the mic in the right position and comfortable position so i'll be introducing a lot lot of noise from the yeah so this is how loud it is right now okay how loud it is right now And I'll be still talking on it, so I'll be I'm going 
going to try out this poly 8225, which is the, sorry, I'm going to try out the poly flat wire 8225, which is the, so far the best headset that I have tried so, um, in, in the three of them. And I hope that the noise sensation really helps. If you look carefully, they have uh, different settings, three different modes, three different settings to, to help you to reduce the uh, surrounding noise. So you can actually reduce it a lot by just, by just changing it, changing the settings over here. So three different levels of um, compression, or I should say three different levels of noise uh, cancel, cancellation. So I always choose the best cancellation because I don't mind the vacuum kind of vacuum sound and yeah so let me let me review the clip but before that before i go i would want to introduce again the vacuum cleaner so this is the vacuum cleaner and again this is the yeah this is the vacuum cleaner so while i'm talking right the vacuum is working so this is without okay this is without the let me let me Okay, this is with the vacuum cleaner on and you can see the dash bar going up about 80 and if I stop it, it drops to 60 something to, yeah, around 60. Okay, and let me review the clip and see how good it is. A few moments later. So to conclude this evaluation, I have tested three different headsets, one from Jabra which is the Java Evolve 230. Two are from Poly, Poly Black Wire 7225 and Poly Black Wire 8225. Among these three, I feel that the Poly 8225 or Black Wire 8225 is the best in terms of performance. However, it's the most expensive among the three of them also. And if you are looking for a very affordable one, I must say that the Jabra Evolve 2 30 is also not so bad. It's around the price range of around 150 or lower if you can find good deals on it. I do think that it really helps. And in terms of headsets, I feel that there's two things that you need to make sure when you buy a headset. One is the noise cancellation. For example, if you have in the north, East area or in the east area there's always a lot of airplanes flying over the HDB blocks. I feel that you need to have a noise cancellation headset in order to focus on your meeting. So for for someone who is living in this kind of area or with some noise coming from the surrounding, the best one is to get one with the noise cancellations. Another thing that you might want to look at is the noise cancellation from the microphone or we call it the microphone noise cancellation why is it important is because for noise cancellation you are able to cancel away the surrounding noise and then when you talk only your voice will be transmitted over to the whatever apps that you are going through with it and this is important because uh, in a busy or noisy environment your sound or your voice must be very clear over all these meeting apps for example it's zoom or microsoft teams and etc this must be it must be able to capture your voice properly and in conclusion if you really want a good headset for meetings like this i would recommend one with a boom mic because that is the best way for you to talk over the microphone and the nearest to your from your mouth to the microphone that is the nearest and that is the clearest that you can actually transmit your voice over and also I would suggest to have the noise cancellation for for your uh, from listening from it there's two type of cancellation one is the passive noise cancellation and another one is the active noise cancellation for passive noise cancellation is basically your hardware which is your your pad your ear pad etc to cancel away the surrounding noise the active noise cancellation is they will measure the surrounding sound and they'll introduce a inverse 
frequency to minus away this sound from the uh, environment and then fit back to your ear so you will feel less noise from the surrounding and more focus on the information that is transmitted over the meeting app and that is it i think i talked too much now that is it i hope to see you around and if you have not subscribed to this channel please do so i will appreciate a lot if you can help to grow this community and that's it stay safe everyone bye bye